Mayor Adams is denying allegations that he sexually assaulted a woman in 1993. The accuser filed a lawsuit today. We want to warn you here, the details are graphic. CBS 2's Dick Brennan here now with more on all of this. Dick. Maurice and Christine, the accuser, says she worked with Adams when he was a transit cop. She says this happened decades ago when she says she went to Adams for help with an employment issue. The allegation against Adams stems from an incident the accuser claims happened in 1993. In the lawsuit, she alleges Adams told her he would drive her home, but instead took her to a vacant lot. It alleges he told her he wanted oral sex in exchange for his help. When she refused the suit charges, she says he forced her into a sex act with her hand. The accusation absolutely did not happen. I don't even recall uh, who this person is. I, I've, I've never recalled even meeting them. And, you know, I spent my life protecting people. That was the mayor's reaction last November when the woman filed a notice of claim under a special New York Adult Survivors Act signed in 2022 by Governor Hochul. It allowed sexual misconduct accusers for one year to file civil lawsuits that otherwise would have been prevented by the statute of limitations. Adams faces re-election in November 2025, and legal experts say this case could move slowly. They're going to have uh, depositions, hearings, um, exchange of documents. And after that, the process, it's, um, the case itself is put on the trial calendar, which also uh, is a pretty lengthy process in the state of New York. So that can take anywhere up to, you know, it can be, a, it can be many years. City Corporation Council Sylvia Hines Raddick said in a statement, while we review the complaint, the mayor fully denies these outrageous allegations and the events described here. We expect full vindication in court. The lawyer for the accuser said the woman knew that filing this lawsuit would cause her significant personal challenges, but she did so nevertheless because she believes sexual abusers must be held to account no matter who they are. The accuser now lives in Florida. She's seeking a jury trial and wants millions of dollars in damages. Maurice. Okay, Dick, thank you. And tomorrow, Mayor Adams is expected to hold his weekly off-topic news briefing. Political reporter Marsha Kramer will be there to ask him about all of this and much more. And for all of our coverage on this story, head over to CBSNewYork.com.